Rudy Giuliani. I mean, think about it. Rudy Giuliani, there's, th there's only three things he mentioned in a sentence, a noun and a verb and 9-11. I mean, there's nothing else. There's nothing else. On this January night, at this defining moment in history, you have done what the cynics said we couldn't do. You know, I have so many opportunities from this country. They just don't want to see us fall backwards. So, tonight, we sure showed them what a comeback looks like. I certainly do remember that trip uh, to Bosnia, and as Togo said, there was a saying around the White House that if a place was too small, too poor, or too dangerous, the president couldn't go, so send the first lady. And that's where we went. And uh, I remember landing under sniper fire, there was supposed to be some kind of a greeting ceremony at the airport, but instead we just ran with our heads down to get into the vehicles. He's the biggest celebrity in the world. But is he ready to lead? Is he ready to lead? Hey America, I'm Paris Hilton and I'm a celebrity too. Only I'm not from the olden days and I'm not promising change like that other guy. I'm just hot. I love those hockey moms. You know, they say the difference between a hockey mom and a pit bull, lipstick. Well, you know, you can't, you know, you, you can put a uh, lipstick on a pig. It's still a pig. A couple of days ago, Senator Obama was out in Ohio and he had an encounter with a guy who's a plumber. His name is Joe Wurzelberger. My name is Joe Wurzelberger. Good to see you, Joe. I'm getting ready to buy a company that yeah. uh, makes 200, about $250,000, $270,000, $80,000 a year. All right. Your new tax plan is going to tax me more, doesn't it? Well, here's what's going to happen. Tonight, I have a privilege given few Americans, the privilege of accepting our party's nomination for President of the United States. and great humility, I accept your nomination for Presidency of the United States.